legendary gang, 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 gang. What's up, y'all? What's going on? I just wanted to, you know, put together a little vlog and um, just talk about what the day is, you know. Today is Mother's Day. And uh, as some of you, maybe most of you, know, you know, I lost my mom uh, back when I was two years old. So around this time is always hard for me, not to mention her uh, death anniversary is on the 10th of uh, May. So it's kind of like a back-to-back -back whammy for me. Um, I'm just basically trying to make the best of it, but I just wanted to come on here and just, you know, tell you guys, like, if you still got your mom, to appreciate her, you know what I mean? Like, mom's not perfect. Mom's gonna fuck up. Mom's gonna make mistakes. Because, you know, you know, when you're born, that doesn't mean they have it all together. They're still growing with you. But, you know, always forgive. Always trying to do what you gotta do and make the best of your relationship with your mom. You feel me? Like, I wish I had my mom still here to see my accomplishments to fight with, to go back to back with, to make hard decisions with, to have silly conversations on the phone with, you know, just a bugger, you know, just to go through heartbreaks with her and, you know, introduce it to my significant others and things like that. Like, I wish I could go through that with my mom, but unfortunately, like, she passed me when I was two, so my whole life, every accomplishment, every hard decision, every milestone, every graduation, every, you know, report card conference, every fight, you know, I felt alone in the situation, and fortunately, God allowed four amazing women in my life to help fill that void of not having my mother, but still around this time, you know, I honor them. But I still think about my biological mother. And that's not going to change. You know, I wish she was here. I wish I could turn back the heads of time. Like, my greatest, most important, is most just precious wish, prayer, is to turn back the heads of time and just wish her to be here in physical form. You know what I mean? I wish she was here. And, you know, a lot of times I sit back and I wonder... Like, what would life be if my mom was here? Like, how would I be? How would I have turned out? What situations would we had went through or, you know, things like that? And it's like, damn, you know, it's, it's, <laughs> it's kind of, you know, crazy. It's kind of, you know, a crazy situation. And I just want y'all to appreciate y'all mothers, appreciate your parent, period, appreciate your parent, period, you know, your mother or your fa father, in the Bible it says, you must honor your mother and your father, no matter what, no matter what, because you never know when the end is near, and when it's the last conversation, or, you know, when it's that last call, or, you know, that last present time that you see them, like, honor your mother, Dolph was the mother, thy father, um, honor them. Seriously, I think for me, it, it, it gets harder every year for me simply because I understand it. You know what I mean? And when I was younger, I didn't really pay too much to it. My sister, my older sister, which is by my mother as well, used to have get like shirts made for us we used to you know celebrate it that way go out to eat and you know things like that N now you know it faded off I'm older now I'm an adult so I kind of do my own thing to remember her by but I say it gets harder for me because you know I get to see you know I'm around people that has kids and get to see that mother experience and things like that and you know with uh, my son but you know he's not my biological son so, I experienced that with him, but I don't think it's going to get any easier. But I think once I have my own biological child, it will help me ease the pain, if that makes sense. You know, because I, I won't be by myself. 
I will be on Mother's Day. I would be more so with my child or my children. And I would be experiencing the love that they have for me. You know what I mean? And it'll probably be a little bit more easier for me. And I'll always, you know, honor their grandmother, my mother, and let them know, you know, what an amazing person I foresee she would have been or is or was, I meant. And, you know, we pretty much go from there, but it's just been hard for me. Like, yesterday and leading up to today, like, I just haven't been myself. And, you know, I'm going through a couple of other different things. And this is just like the icing on the cake for this year to come around. You know what I mean? This time of year. And it's like, what do you... Not like, what do you do? But, you know, I just pray about it. And I just, you know, keep my hand up, keep my chest out, and, you know, try to make the best of it. So, right now, I'm about to go hang with my friends. Um, we about to go out and, you know, just do a little couple different things out on the town, you know. Um, just to take my mind off of it. They support me. They know what's going on. They know, you know. That I did lose my mom, so it's it's good to for them to want to come together and be like, all right, we got you. Like, you know what I mean? Like, we're going to do something for you. We're going to chill. You know, they called and checked on me. And these are people that I, I met within the last year. You know what I mean? So it's like, it's like, all right, that's cool. That's good shit. You feel me? That's one thing about living down south, you know. It, it's bad people everywhere. But it's some good, good people that have a lot of hospitality and they they care when they say they care, you feel me? And it's just, you know, a different atmosphere, a different environment that, you know, you know, that is felt down here. So I like to, I like to thank them for that you know and I appreciate that um you know in theory I've always been the type that it's not how long you knew a person it's not blood it's how loyal they are to you it's how they treat you and it's how you know they're there at different points of time in your life you know and which makes them who they are, you know, to you, so I appreciate that for sure, um, but no, I mean, I'm just, just gonna rock for the day, I just came on and do a little vlog for y'all, tell y'all happy Mother's Day, you know, I hope y'all good, I hope y'all prosper, and I hope y'all treating y'all moms well, got gifts for y'all mom, and different things like that, and if you're a mother, happy Mother's Day, I know you work hard. I know your kids appreciate you. It's, it's legend. Y'all already know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe, and turn your notifications on so you know when we dropping another lit, lit, lit video. Let's go. Okay.